Hey everyone, it's Lou and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I just wanted to make a video basically about the updates that are going on in life at the moment. I have it all on my phone, I've got it in my notes which I actually need to bring up because I'm not prepared apparently, I'm just not prepared. So today is the 20th of February and let me tell you, today's the first time I ever went to a official football game. Sheffield United, we won. <laughs> but it was fun, let me tell you that. So that's something to tick off in 2022 already. In today's video, I just wanted to make a quick update on everything that's going to be happening in the year 2022. So you've got some things to look forward to on my YouTube channel and I am so excited to film them, upload them, get them edited. I think as well I am wanting to find a new editing software to edit on because at the minute I use iMovie and as great as it's been for all these years I think I'm ready to, what's the word, what is the word? Make my content better, that's not the word but it's definitely the, the thing that I'm going for. Advance in editing, there we go, I'd love to advance my stuff. Um, so if Final Cut Pro might not be the thing for me. Let me know down below. Maybe it is. That's kind of the thing that I was going to go for, Final Cut Pro. But if not, let me know any kind of editing software that you think is good that, you know, I think I'm prepared to do my research on things. I'm prepared to watch YouTube videos on how to do certain things. So let's get right on into this video about all the updates and events. So first of all, I had York on the list and I have now done York. Um, it was the Valentine's Day weekend, so me and Simon went to York and I have the vlog. I have a few days worth of footage and I shall get that up as my next video, hopefully, fingers crossed. I shall get that up next and I think that it could turn out good. You know, I've tried to maybe do some like montage stuff as well as vlogging, so hopefully that will turn out great. It involves some little ghosty stuff. It involves the things that we did, walking around York, sightseeing, all the great little things, the hotel, what it all looked like. It was so much fun. I absolutely loved my little weekend away in York because people that know me know that York is my favourite place. The shambles. Oh, I just love it all so, so much. We had a little boat ride. It was all so much fun and as always, it was my favourite and I hope to go again, <laughs> maybe in the summertime. So it's not raining 24 seven because it did rain the whole entire time. But for me, rain's the best thing ever. So I had the greatest time in York, living my little rainy hours life. So onto the next thing, in April, I believe, I do have Miss Madison Beer to look forward to. I am going to see Madison Beer in, oh my God, where am I seeing her? Nottingham. <laughs> Nottingham? I'm going to Nottingham. No, I'm Birmingham. Oh my god. I'm going to Birmingham to see Madison Beer. And I will be going with Jess. Um, hopefully you all remember Jess. She was in my Malfoy Manor video. Uh, I'm going with her friend Amber and I'm going with my best friend Victoria. As I did actually surprise her for Christmas. I got her tickets. Come on, we gotta go and see a concert together because she's never actually been to one before. So I thought I'd get her tickets for a concert and Madison Beer was is a great person to go and see. I am so excited to see her. I remember doing a reaction video to life support. So I'm excited to see Madison. Um, I can't wait to get my outfit for it, do my hair all cute, go and see her and have the best night ever. So that is a vlog that I want to make. Next, I have another concert. Okay, I have another concert. Me and Alicia are going to this one in Manchester. One morning I woke up, I went on TikTok and I scrolled down and I saw this girl and she was like, I managed to get Harry Styles tickets. And I was like, it's Harry Styles day. So I went straight to messaging Alicia. I was like, so do you still kind of want to watch Harry Styles? And she was like, yes. And I was like, right, I'm on it. <laughs> so I went and got tickets for Manchester night one. Um, we have our hotel booked and we're going to stop overnight, make it a little thing because obviously we've got to travel down there. This one is the one that I'm most excited for, outfit wise. Mr. Harry Styles. I already have my white boots. They're very tall, so that's a good thing because I'm in general admission, which I'm grateful for because honestly, I can't wait to dance with everyone. Like I literally can't wait to meet people and dance with them and just have so much fun. I'm just so excited. Harry Styles concerts look so wholesome and I'm glad that he's added more dates so that more people can go and see him. <laughs> so another thing that's coming up as well in March, it's my birthday, it's gonna be my 23rd. And for that, I was like, you know what? I haven't done anything for the past two birthdays because of lockdown. And my last one was my 21st birthday. No, it was not, it was my 22nd. The time before the 22nd was my 21st birthday and I actually did nothing for it. Um, 
So that was fun. I really enjoyed that. Last year, I actually vlogged last year, the 22nd birthday. If you want to go and watch that, please go and watch it. I actually really liked that video. It's kind of cute. I tried to make the most of my day. Um, but I loved every single gift that I got. And that's when I had my ukulele given to me. So I am very grateful for that. I love my ukulele so, so much. So going back to what I was on about. Me and Simon are planning a trip for like two nights. We kind of want to go somewhere abroad. We're not too sure on where to go just yet. And I want to say... Milan or Berlin could be on the list. We kind of want to go somewhere in Europe, keep it close, but also make it an adventure, you know? We want to do something, so we are trying our best to try and find some places. So again, anywhere in Europe, comment down below and we will be sure to check those places out. The summertime. So that's obviously our favorite time ever. I am finally able to say that I am going to go on holiday and I know that I will be this time. That's like a good thing for me. I have waited so long to be able to go abroad and I think that place is going to be Italy. A dream come true, a literal dream come true. I do love Italy. I think in my bucket list video I was talking about how I wanted to visit Juliet's balcony. Um, I don't, even if I didn't go to see Juliet's balcony, you know, I'm still in Italy and I'm still on holiday abroad in the sunshine. Like this is more than what I've had in a very, very long time. So literally anywhere I would be grateful for and I'm so excited to go abroad and make travel videos. <laughs> like literally all I've ever wanted was like to make travel videos. So here we go, here's the travel videos. <laughs> so that's a massive one to look forward to. That could possibly be like for a week um, holiday. So that I can't wait for. Those obviously will be like vlogs, travel vlogs, montages, stuff like that. Seen as though I have my new camera now, I'm filming on my Canon M50. I got the white one, I absolutely adore it. I'm so glad that I did get the white one. And I actually got a microphone for it also a little fluffy one and i'm walking around with my little fluff on my camera <laughs> people do get very intrigued but i'm learning to be able to like overcome that because the g7x was so small and compact i was able to just do it anywhere and everywhere but the m50 is pretty big and obnoxious i will not lie so i'm trying to like get used to that and york was the first time that i did use it so i think that i could get a little bit more used to it but i do love my camera so so much up next i think two times two times maybe i will be going to london this year the first one me and mel we are i literally joined her live and we planned a trip to London. Um, I was just popping in to say hello and she was like, oh, by the way, Lou, um, we should do something together because she has her camera now. Um, I think she's gonna start making a YouTube channel. She's Mel My Dog on TikTok. She makes Harry Potter content and she's absolutely insane at it. She visits all the locations and literally she's, she's great. She's just great and she's growing on TikTok and it's really nice to see and I'm so proud of her. So we might be going to London. We might be vlogging together. I think that that would be so, so cute. Literally just for vlogging purposes. I know that she wants to start a YouTube channel now and I am fully here for it. And the second London trip, I think as a family, we are going to see one of my favourite films ever but obviously as a show. So one of my favourite films in the whole entire world is Moulin Rouge and I think that we are possibly going to see Moulin Rouge in theatre, which is going to be a whole experience. I don't think it's like the film though, I, I honestly don't know, but either way I think it's going to be one of the best shows I've ever seen in my life. The Moulin Rouge, I cannot wait. My auntie and uncle went not long ago and they said they really enjoyed it, so I literally, I'm so excited, like I, I saw someone on Instagram not long ago and they had a picture outside of the Moulin Rouge and I was like, I need that picture, so I'm gonna get that picture. So for the girls, Laura has now moved from Nottingham and she's now moved to Birmingham and we're all so excited about this, we have a new place to go. Laura, you're literally like, we're living our life through you um, and it's so much fun. So Birmingham's gonna be the place this year. Liverpool was last year in Nottingham, <laughs> so now we're testing new waters, we're gonna see what that's like. Yeah, hopefully I can get the girls vlogs back together again because they're so much fun to watch back on. I absolutely love making them and I just love the memories that we do make from the videos. I should be going to Newcastle at some point, I actually have never been to Newcastle before. So I am super excited about that. I cannot wait. And just I've got a lot of things planned. So I'm really, really excited for this year. 
it started off mm, rocky. I'll say that it started off a bit rocky, but to be honest, I'm happier than what I was last year, so I, I'm, I'm very happy. I'm just gonna put this out here. I, I really wanna go to Alton Towers, um, and I really need a new Alton Towers vlog. But yes, that was today's video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the bell notification to be notified every time I upload a new video. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.